Hey there everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider 2! And we are now dealing with more yetis, as you can plainly hear and see briefly. So in this level, we have the introduction of a new gimmick. A gimmick that can get you killed very easily if you're not careful with it. You notice these little pressure pads on the floor. Well, you see what happens when we walk over them. Yep. They're actually springboards. We need to jump forward onto this one to make it... There we go. And yes, we do have to shoot the bells to, like, open up doors and things. Oh, wait. And yeah, right now, I just need to go up here. I actually need to go up higher than that. It's not the easiest thing. I think we released the Yetis. Yes, we did. Wait, was there something up here? Oh, no, there's not. Oh, yeah, they- oh, yeah, they can jump up and, like, climb like that. Ah, I don't want to drop down on that. I think we do this. No, not that. What the heck do we do here? Wait a sec. Alright, there we go. Oh, wait. Th that was not a good idea. Hold up, what am I missing here? Oh, wait a sec, what's this? Oh, what? This leads around to a thing that I need, doesn't it? Oh. 
Welp. No wonder I couldn't figure that out. Is the first secret somewhere around here? I know there's a pushable block somewhere. It might not have been here, though. But it's relatively early on in the level. See, I didn't remember this room being anything particularly complicated. Well, now we got that solved. back and forth here. Actually, a quicker way to do this would probably be to just uh, shimmy along the ledge. Hold up, is there something hidden down here by any chance? No, guess not. At least I get to demonstrate what I meant. <sighs> I feel like I missed the first secret. I mean, I could still go back for it. I, I feel like it's down there somewhere. Or maybe not, it might be up here. Oh, well, there's the silver dragon, but that's not the one that I... Or the stone dragon, rather, but that's not the one I'm looking for. So I did miss it somewhere. But it's okay, I can go back and get it, though. Let's not go down there yet. I'm not sure if I can get back up once I go there. Oh, I was looking for a block that had like a, like a little pulley thing on it. I, I, oh, I, I must have been thinking of Tomb Raider 1. I, I knew that block looked a little off when I ran by it before. Yeah, very well hidden secret here that I definitely did not find without a guide. And yeah, I know, you're probably thinking, how the heck do you get across this? Well... Yep. Simple as that. I think it might be the only case of, like, an invisible walkway in the entire game. 
Unless I'm just derping, which the likelihood of that is usually fairly high. Anyway, let's get on with this adventure. Oh, that's not a slope, okay. Yeah, if we want the- whoa! Hello! I was hitting the wrong button for flares. Uh -huh. No, not the harpoon gun. <laughs> yeah, this really is not a good weapon to use while jumping around. Let's just use the automatic pistols. There's no reason why that should have gone that bad. Uh -huh. Now we've got a mask that I'm not sure where to use. Probably missed a receptacle for it out here somewhere. Oh, hold up. Uh -huh. Got a med pack. Wait. Oh, wait. New area over here? I believe so. Oh my gosh, that was so close. You'll understand why that was so close here very soon. Yeah. Oh. Well, there you got to see that animation in full. Yetis in this game don't mess around. Okay. Uh -huh. Do all of these have spikes under them? Yeah, they do. I 
I think the way that I did it is like the intended way. Actually, wait. Oh no, I could have dropped down right there. That's how they intend you to do that. Here we go, you might recognize this place a little bit. Here's where we use that mask. Anything in there? No. But yes, we now return to, uh, yeah, th this area from the, uh, first, or the previous level. Also, I should probably save. I mean, is there something over there? I know it's not a secret, but... Oh. I do see flares down here. Uh -huh. I think in the event that we fall down there, the... Yeah, the terrain has been rearranged a little bit so we'd be able to get back up. Here, you'll remember this area, too. So yeah, that melted the ice, so now we can swim down here. And get ourselves this thing. What is it? It is a gong hammer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I heard tigers, didn't I? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Lots and lots of grenades.
Let's not get crushed by snowballs. Did they by any chance put anything up here? I'm not sure if I ever went back and checked. No, they didn't. You know, that would have been a good place to put, like, some ammo or something. Falling down there would be a very, very bad idea. But I probably don't need to tell you that. Falling down there would probably also be a very bad idea, though I'm curious if there's something down there. We can't at least climb all the way down. And it is there to waste your time. to self heal before dropping and with that We have opened the way. Well, actually, we haven't opened the way to anything, but we have uh, summoned the boss, and I'm actually not sure if it was a smart idea to hit that before going for the last secret, so I'm not going to save until I know for sure. Speaking of the last secret, I believe the switch we need to access it is down here somewhere. Either that, or it was... Wait a minute. No, I think it was down there? Ah, oh, yeah, there's a ladder going down over here. Oof. Oh, dang it, why did I not- oh, oh yeah, right. I know why I didn't save. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I thought maybe holding action while you fall there could, like, potentially, uh, negate the fall damage, but... No, it does not work that way. Okay, so yeah, I think if we, like, walk into, like, the, uh, middle of this room, I think it makes the boss spawn, so let's stay away from the center for now. You can see spikes down that way, so that is not the way to go. And the last secret is in there. And there is nothing there. Okay.
Now we got even more grenade ammo. Do we need it? Not really, but we got it. I don't think there's anything hidden up on the ice. If there is, I probably missed it. Unless we can get back up there. Oh, wait a sec. I made a mistake. Hitting the gong opens this. Uh -huh. And now that we've picked that up, now the boss is going to spawn. But first, let's let's take a quick peek up here, just, just to be sure. I know I, I've really been going overboard checking every nook and cranny in this level, but... I am curious. And it would appear there is nothing. Alright, come on big bird. Ow, I might want to heal. Yeah, not exactly difficult. Just don't let it get close to you. Anyway, that is the last of the icy levels. Up next, we have the longest level in the entire game. See you then.